Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we are going to be getting ready together. Uh, so I'm going to be doing skincare and makeup, and then I'll also do your skincare and your makeup as well. Then we'll just do the same steps. So we already washed our face, we did that earlier in the bathroom, remember? And then we also brushed our teeth. So next we're going to be doing, I'm going to put a headband on. There we go. Apologize if I literally look like a weirdo with this headband on. It's fine, it has a little bow. Yours has a little bow too. Just a little bow. Okay. So then the next thing we're going to do is I have this Paula's Choice Exfoliate BHA, it's a 2% BHA liquid exfoliator, exfoliant. So we're going to be taking a pad, got a pad, how was your day? Been going so far at least because it's literally the start of the day. It's good. Thing on my face. Okay. I'm grabbing one from you now because we're not going to share contacts. It's just not, not how it's going to be. I'm going to have one for some of mine. very refreshing putting this stuff on doing skincare is very refreshing I'm sure you can relate to me on that okay so after we do that we are going to move on to a vitamin C serum this is by La Roche So I'm just going to put some on my hand, like so, okay, and then we're going to put it on your face, there we go, all good, and then we're going to put some on my face. Well, just do it like this. And I do a different routine in the night rather than this. So instead of vitamin C serum, I put on niacin red and a s another one. I don't remember what it's called though. I to put on a niacinamide firming eye serum, which I do both at night and in morning. So we're just going to dot a little onto our finger. And then just right onto the eyes. Right onto the eyes. And then I'm going to get something for myself. on my eyes and we got 
Yeah. So the last thing we're going to do, or second to last thing, is we're going to put on some coconut water cream. This is a hydrator, like a moisturizer type thing. I'm gonna do me first. It always gets stuck under my nail. Okay, now we're gonna do you. So then the last thing we're going to do we're gonna put on this mask. And I know this is like a sleeping mask, but I like putting it on in the morning as well, just because I feel like hydrating. It's very sticky, not gonna lie, on the finger. Let's put them on you. Pick your lips like there we go and then I'm just going to wipe off my finger because yeah I don't want it to be sticky when I'm doing my makeup and that's the next thing we're actually going to be doing is our makeup the makeup bag and now we're going to do a very simple look today because I'm not going anywhere, and I don't want to do too much. So the first thing we are going to do is we're going to use the Marshmallow Primer by NYX. Recently started using this, and I really like it. And I'm sure you're going to like it as well. So I'm just going to dot some. I'll do me first, and then I'll do you. And it literally smells so good. I love the smell of it. Pretty. Okay. So then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to use this L'Oreal Lumi Glow Shin. It's like a helps your skin glow. I'm just going to do, do that, and then I do it over here, that's not enough, there we go, do a little on the nose, and then do a little down here, and then we're going to rub it in, and we're going to put some on me. So then we're going to go in with this NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer. Okay, so we're just going to put it in like some small spots because we're not doing like an, a really big makeup look. Obviously I'm going to cover my um, boo boo areas. I'm going to keep that out for you. And then And like this does very minimal cut or has a very minimal coverage which is something that i like i prefer honestly because i like having like my natural skin exposed so it like doesn't look like that i like caked on or anything so that is what we did and we are all done with that now i'm going to do you so we're just You have no blemishes, which is so unfair. You are literally beautiful. I wish, I wish I could be like that. I'm working on it. Recently got a new 
um, face wash. I used to use Proactive when I was younger and it worked wonders on my skin, but it's so drying that I decided to take a break from it for a little bit. And I legit don't remember what I used like a year ago because it worked on my skin. And then I switched and I started using something else and it just wasn't working on my skin. And then I switched again, tried another thing, wasn't working on my skin. So I was like, all right, we're just going to go back to proactive because I have acne prone skin. So I like need to control it again before I can move on and use a more hydrating not moisturizer, face wash. Okay. So after that, we are going to set that in place. I'm going to take this and then I'm just going to put it like under the eye on the eyelid because that is where the creases come into play on me at least. And then we're going to take some and put it in the T zone because that is also where I am I'm literally most oily. And then we're going to also like kind of run down the nose a little bit. Put it on the spots that come on the nose, put it on my chin, 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 and then just kind of dot it on those other places that I have. And then we're going to do that to you as well. Okay. We're going to use the Charlotte Tilbury Contour Wand. And I'm just going to dot, dot, very light. Oh god, that was not light at all. I kind of just put it like in those places and then on my nose. My nose contour is always so off if it looks good, but it's okay. And then we're going to blend it in with a blush. I think this is like the best purchase I've ever made. I literally love Charlotte Tilbury so much i have their blush as well and i want to get the highlighter i just haven't yet to buy it because makeup for me like has never been something i've like bought i always spend my money on clothes and i don't need any new clothes right now i have to try saving money because i have to pay for college next year i just and I also want to get a MacBook so badly because my computer right now, like, it works, but it's not, like, efficient in what I need it to be in, if that makes sense. Like, it also dies if it's not plugged in. Its battery life is not good at all, and I've had it for a while, so I think it's time to update. And I want to make a big girl purchase and buy a MacBook. So, yeah. Okay, so now we're going to do you. You have very snatched cheekbones. It's something I've always been jealous of for people. It's like a snatched bone look that people have. I don't. I have a very soft look, I feel like. Like, I, I don't have a baby face, but like, I definitely don't have a mature face. <laughs> that makes sense. I'm very hungry. I'm really excited to eat. I haven't had breakfast yet. I really want some bronzer. And you're gonna watch me struggle to open it for a little bit because I cannot get it open ever. It's because I have nails, so I can't like, and the nails are too thick to get in a little crease. That's in, oh, look, yeah, I got it. Okay, so I'm gonna take this e.l.f. brush as well. I really like this brush like I really was sleeping on elf the longest time we're not putting that much on but like I really looked past it and I never should have because their products are so good okay now we're gonna do you on the eyes and we're done blush we're gonna do charlotte tilbury as well just a little bit 
I accidentally put way too much on yesterday and it was a nightmare. I didn't realize how much was on the um, applicator and so I kind of just like smudged it onto my face like on this cheek and so much product came out I was like oops. I literally looked like I was a little clown for a little bit before I fixed it. It was really funny though I will say. And then we're just gonna take the residue and just put it on the eyelid and like kind of like make it go down into that spot and then on the nose obviously your turn and it's such a pretty color too i really like it oh i forgot to put a little dot on your nose okay okay we're gonna take the brush it's <laughs> like the right brush. And and I'm so sorry for that beeping in the background. I can't, but it's just so annoying. I'm so, I apologize. I don't have soundproof walls or a soundproof window. I swear to god, if that messes up my video, I'm actually going to cry. Okay, so then the next thing we are going to do is eyebrows. I'm going to put on this fluff up brow wax. I think, yeah, this. So, it's going to just fluff up the brows. I need to pluck my brows. I haven't been plucked in a fat minute. And they're literally so bad. Actually, I did pluck them recently. I don't know why they grow back all of a sudden. It's your turn. There we go. Perfect. So we're just going to brush. Just like a little comb going through. Okay. I feel like I did the rest of my makeup, so I might as well just put mascara on as well. Okay. And then we're gonna curl using this creepy little thing. That's kind of broken, like I'm not gonna lie, mine's just not running the boat. She's just not doing good, but it's okay. And we're doing one at a time, and then we're gonna take telescopic by L'Oreal, one of my favorite mascaras of all time. Just going to put a little bit on. And then I'm not gonna do bottom lashes today. I'm just gonna give them a break. Okay. Brow out Alrighty. My lashes are done. I'm not doing that much. I'm just doing a little bit. So now we're gonna do you. One of the final steps is going to be highlighter, and I'm using this Milani palette that I've had for forever. Yeah, it's been a fat minute since I've gotten it, but it's literally my favorite highlighter of all time. Because I'm not a big like fan of super intense highlighter. I like just the subtle like little glow to the skin, like not too much. And then we're gonna do on the tip of the nose. Mm -hmm. On the eyebrow. We're done. Okay, one final step. And this step is going to be 
setting spray. I use Morphe, or I at least have been using Morphe. I'm going to go to Urban Decay and get, or like use that stuff to see. That actually did not taste good at all. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna take this off. I showered not too long ago, so my hair is kind of like chaotic and all over the place, but it's okay. So, and then we're going to take your headband off, so we're just going to... Perfect. Alrighty, and you look lovely. I hope you feel good, and I'm, you look like a badass, so... Anyway. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. That is the end, obviously, because we're done with our makeup and everything. Um, if you liked this video and you are not subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. Um, I, you know, I'm kind of all over the place when I make videos, so who knows when the next video will come? Because I don't. And I'm also in school right now and I'm very depressed, so... Oh, whenever I feel like making a video, I'll just make one, because that's what I did today. I felt like making one, and I was like, yeah, we're going to make one, and I'm going to upload. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I love you so much. Thank you for all the support. I did that backward. Thank you for all the support that you've been giving me, and I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in a next, or the next video. Or I'll see you when I see you. Bye.